is um, terrible. Mm -hmm. No, we don't have terrible music here. Okay. Listen to radio. See what young people are doing. Yeah. See what the, see what Joe Metal is doing. See mm. what Kiddy is doing. Mm -hmm. uh, Kel songs. Yeah. Uh, Kwame Eugene. Kwame Eugene. See what uh, this, I just told you Perry. call that terrible music. No. Yeah. If it was in Nigeria, you will see that even if it is terrible, he will let you think that is the best thing you've heard. Yeah. It's a character. Okay. It's, it, we, we don't have to uh, have to. We don't, we don't, no, no. We don't have to have learned how to do it. We have to be intentional. We'll take a pen and paper. Okay, I'm, I'm going to support my national okay. music. I'm going to do this. And if it, any person to do anything to Im impact our arts, it is not giving money. Mm. It is high courts. Okay. All right. Right. GH1 must know that, okay, because of the constitution, mm -hmm. I can only play uh, one or two foreign music today. Mm -hmm. And so I need more Ghanaian content. Where mm -hmm. is it? Right. That's, that's how to move forward. Okay. Yeah. So, so with the whole controversy, again, um, concerning the whole Shatawali whiskey, do you think what Shatawali did was right? Because we're talk I, talking I think, about the gun. Um, I, think that, I think that, you know, if Shatawali is praising whiskey, mm -hmm. nobody will be concerned about it. Okay. The only way Shatawali gets attention is to be himself, mm. you know, after a good um, smoke, <laughs> you know, come out and just give it out. Mm. Okay? Do I disrespect Shatawali for doing that? No. Okay. Should he do that? Um, I think shooting um, the not. gun in the air. Oh, shooting him. a gun in the air is a big issue. Mm. Why should you do that? Why should you do that? Because you know, if you sit in front of the Ghana president mm -hmm. and tell the Ghana president that children are listening to you. Do you understand? And mm -hmm. you go and take gun mm -hmm. and you are shooting in the air. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? A president has given you on, on, honor to come and sit with him and you tell the president that children are looking to you. The next week you go and take gun, you are shooting in the air. Do you understand? It makes a president maybe even regret for hosting you. Mm. Do you understand? If we respect a president, you don't do that. Yeah. Somebody was saying that, oh, it's because he's going to see the president. And I said, oh, it's not because he's going to see the president. This is something he's doing. What is, going to, what is actually going to happen now is that young people who have his fans mm -hmm. are going to think that having a gun is right. For even practice. Okay. It's okay. For just practice. Yeah. All right. It's yeah. okay. We saw what people who had guns did. John, mm. uh, what's his name? That musician just had a gun, yeah. had issue with a taxi driver mm -hmm. and thought that shooting the gun or testing it mm -hmm. uh, to show his anger was okay. And so I think that um, it's quite very irresponsible that he did that. Mm. As much as I respect him as a very influential artist in Ghana, yeah. you don't use your influence to do that. Someone even said, a friend of mine said, um, you know when you are a diehard die hard fan of Shatawali yeah. and he does something like that and maybe Whiskey even comes to perform and Shata is not even pulling out a gun. That fan yeah. would feel like I should actually shoot for Shata because yeah. I love him and yeah. I love everything oh, that he I mean, does. Uh, so they can yeah, even do the job said. for things him. Things are not said. <laughs> things are not said. Mm. All right. And maybe I may not be the one to say it. Mm. But things happen at shows. Mm. Do you understand? And yeah. the security people will tell you what happened after every show or at this show. But mm. those things are not publicized. Okay. Sometimes people die. Yeah. Sometimes people are killed. Mm. I mean, look at what happened to Stoneboy's wife. Yes. Do you understand? Yeah. If he had gone through him, through her, what would have happened? Sure. You get it? Of yeah. course, um, as much as we are doing dancehall and whatever. We to Ghana, we have a culture. And maybe we may want to have a culture in Ghana mm -hmm. that is doing dancehall, mm -hmm. that it doesn't include guns. Mm. Yes. Okay. Yeah. But I see, I see you know a lot about what's happening in the secular I musical am, I, world. Do, I, I, do you listen I, I, to secular music? Yeah, who's I your mean, favorite? Smith is great. Who's Why your not? favorite? I like, artist. I like, I like all of them. I like all of them. The other day, I was watching. Shata you Wallis. have to do a freestyle of your favorite song. I was watching Shatawali's new t video. You <laughs> were some Chinese people are that. <laughs> you know, so Shatawali's your right? favorite artist? He's not my favorite artist. Who's your favorite? Who are I, I, I don't think I have a favorite. Okay. All of them are great. Mm. Yes. But would you ever collaborate with I'm any of them favorite, on the song? I'm not so they can't be my favorite. Oh, maybe you are. You never oh, know. Yeah, no, you but never I don't know. have to be their favorite to be relevant. Mm. You see. Of so course, I know that. Uh, yeah, but but otherwise, I, the, all of them I respect, mm. I love, I mm -hmm. honor them. They mm -hmm. are great. Yeah. You see. Mm. But I don't have a particular person who is like my favorite. I'm, I'm listening mm. crazy about. Okay. I think I'm crazy about all of them. But all would you ever do a great. collaboration with someone doing this? this if we music? have, if we have, have uh, if we have recently? a project, yeah. if we have a project, okay. I think people are suffering. If uh, maybe this Libya issue like this, if even there's a song, why not? It would be fun. But mm. I can't do a collaboration that we are praising God. Mm. Lord, you are mighty. Mm. 
uh, Lord, you are, we, we can't do that. I don't joke with mm -hmm. God to think that um, somebody singing about how uh, uh, big somebody's bottles is and how well <laughs> they can bang it or something. Then, <laughs> then you are mm -hmm. Father, you are mighty. Yeah. You see? No, we'll be ending in lame. Okay. Do you understand? But mm. we can do a project. Okay. We can do a project to talk about what's happening in the street, what's happening in the nation, right. what's happening with this. Mm. But otherwise, I'm not under pressure to collaborate with any okay. body. So, Samini and Stoneboy, mm -hmm. who do you think is the, the best dance or artist? These two. I, I, I think it's not them. about the best. Okay. Okay? Mm. It's about... Uh, Whose songs honor. do you It's about to? honor. Honor, okay. Uh, both Shatawali and um, um, Stoneboy. Yeah. Should honor samini okay all right okay perhaps when they were not relevant mm. he was pushing it mm. but today i saw some things shatawali tweeted about um samini, samini. quite very disrespectful and mm. i said that you cannot behave like you can't do this and nobody will do it to you okay do you see when yes. you do it that you think shatawali of course might be or think that he's only this but some small boy will rise in ghana here do you understand and Who, I think uh, uh, some people will rise in ghana here and when they rise um, whatever you th how Shatawali also came Shoot and everybody it. followed, and it's like Samini mm -hmm. wasn't like the king of whatever, whatever. Yeah. It, it, it happens, mm. and so when you are, it's your time, you honor those who have been here already. Okay. If you disrespect them, there's a generation that will come and disrespect you. Okay. It's, 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 it's life, you cannot mm. shut the we, no matter what they do, Ghanaians know um, their father. If they don't know, Ghanaians know their father. Mm. Yes. Okay. Uh, All right. So, so now I, I don't make comparisons between them. All of okay. them. No, if they can release big hit songs, but still their father is there. Mm. Mm. Okay. And they, and they can insult their family. father, but we Ghanaians know their father. <laughs> you know who the father is. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> okay. Um. So I'm actually on your Twitter right now, and the last thing you tweeted, and you were talking about how to support Ghanaian music. You said pray for the music industry, wish them well, make efforts to get and share their music, yeah. demand and request them played wherever, write and speak well of them, believe in them, and intentionally honor them. Do you feel like people don't support you the way they have to, yes, especially the yes. Ghanaian music oh, oh, industry? You see, because um, honor, uh, you have to, the Bible says that the prophet is not honored in their, in their city. Yeah. And so a city has to decide to honor their prophet. Mm. Uh, a city has to make an intentional decision to mm. do. A radio station must make an intentional decision to do. A TV station must make an intentional decision to do. People must make an intentional decision. It's not about feelings. Mm. Don't feel Feelings are nothing. Okay. People who enter marriages, <laughs> or people who feelings are nothing. Okay. Young people treasure feelings, <laughs> but mm. the feeling will go. Okay. When you re you come and value commitment, mm. you come and value trust, you come and value integrity. Mm. All right, yeah. which has nothing to do with feelings but decisions. Mm. You see, so um, we must just uh, intentionally make a decision not mm. to do one year uh, something then. You, you honor musicians, the musicians are happy, they wear, wear, wear big, big, big suits, go and collect one award and fight <laughs> over the award. It's not honor. <laughs> okay. When they finish, they don't play your music. Right. They, they, but you we, see we, 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 we play your music. We Blessed support you. We support Blessed you 100. Blessed Guys, so Blessed speaking of supporting music, <laughs> as I mentioned earlier on, um, this is a part of the show where we take songs from, of course, our celebrity guest. And he has selected five songs. We've dealt with two. We have three more to go. What was the third song you selected? Uh, I, um, Sonny Badu. Sonny Badu. Sonny okay. Badu, Are you a uh, fan of Sonny Badu? Am I a fan of Sonny mm. Badu? I am uh, a fan, um, a loyalist, mm. a lover, mm. and somebody I honor. Okay. I think Sonny Badu has done for gospel music what Africa gospel should do. Mm. If you have a show in America right now, you don't have Sonny Badu on it, or even in. If you're having a show that is going to host a lot of people, you don't have Sonny Badu on it, maybe you've not done your checklist well. Okay. And so he's, uh, he's gotten somewhere that I desire to go. Mm. And so he's somebody I honor and okay. respect. Yeah. And, um, and, and and I just honor him. Okay, and the third, the, the second song? Bononi mm -hmm. by Joe Metal. Bononi. Uh, yeah. Okay, right. I'm not even going to ask you about why you selected that song because you've spoken on the fact okay. that you actually like Joe Metal. So guys, let's check out the two music videos. As I said, if you want to get interactive, and I will find you by, okay, Lacre to 
to Kwesi. Okay. Hey. <laughs> Kwesi, I think. Really I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> the person is trying to find you. Uh -huh. Kwesi, your song next in line is really being a blessing. I love you very much. Um, okay. Um, Ninafi says, I love you, Kwesi, your thing. You uh -huh. are my motivator. Thank God you. bless you. G.H. Rockefeller says, what Kwesi is saying is very true. Just like Jamaica Alkaline, Alkaline, um, very young guy came out and kicked vibes cocktail lyrically. Shatawale thinks he would never grow old. His time would definitely come. We will live to see his downfall. His attitude and manners is just a uh, cock. Okay, what's that? Very ungrateful. <laughs> okay. Oh, um, I don't so think um, we, we are interested in seeing Shatawale's downfall. Downfall, exactly. I don't think mm. um, so one thing to say is downfall is a thing. Mm. But... Yeah, I mean, I think if anybody, um, I, when he sleeps at night, mm -hmm. he should he should um, want to find a way to, f you know, begin a culture of honor. Yeah. Especially people who have been there. Yes. No matter the issues, just make sure that you are sowing our seeds of honor. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Right. Um, more messages on Twitter. Um, Joe Church, shouts going out to you. Um, lots of messages. A lot of people saying you're making sense. Osu Manche, um, you're also watching. Shouts going out to you. And Corredo King. And to Hills Lookout GH, um, shouts going out to you as well. And Brad Casper, you guys have sent in lots of messages. And this one says, hi, please tell Chris your thing. I like him. And please, when will you bring Chris Waddle onto the show? Um, we'll definitely work on that. Now, I'm going straight to your Twitter again because okay. there's something interesting I saw there. And mm. it's something, it's a pressing issue that a lot of us have seen and I think it's very barbaric and very inhuman for mm. something like that to be happening in our 21st century. Yeah. And I've seen a lot of celebrities are talking about it and a lot of people in power. But the question is, what are we as individuals doing to fight it? So he said, the Libyan situation is a result of a failure of African leadership. No African would need to go anywhere else for shelter if our shelter was well managed by the selfish people who have led and failed so miserably, which is actually very true. But then again, please throw more light on, on what you actually tweeted concerning this oh, Libyan Africa, situation. Africa has a destiny. Mm. You know, recently um, there's a research that the black man's brain mm -hmm. is uh, can do better than a white man's brain. <laughs> the black man's brain mm. has the potential to do better than a white man's brain. Mm. Here in Africa, we've had very bad, selfish, you know, you would think that a person maybe who has been hungry before, mm -hmm. given the opportunity, would have made another person not hungry. Mm. But the hungry person got an opportunity, got there, and forgot that he's been hungry before. And that's we've had yeah. that type of leadership. And it has created... Um, a situation where the population has grown irrespective of the bad leadership and the bad uh, situations we've had with jobs and mm -hmm. things. Yeah. The, it didn't change. It didn't make our population small. Yeah. People still had sex. There's yes. been growth of population. Mm -hmm. And people are trying to fulfill their dreams. They've yes. waited for years. It's not and happening. They want happening. to run. They have to take life in the They want to run out of this hell Misery. <laughs> of place mm. to be. Mm. Do you get it? And... Yes. Um, they are trying it going through Libya yeah. and um, see the situation there. But Chris, you Wickedness. Know what? This slavery thing, I don't think, has ever ended. Even amongst we, the blacks, even in our homes. Sometimes you go and visit somebody and you see a house help who works from morning till dusk. They don't sleep, yeah. they don't eat, they're not fed properly. I've even seen stories you know, like, where somebody butchered a house help this middle because East the folks person didn't cook don't for them. They don't respect blacks at all. Mm. They don't respect blacks at yeah. all. If you, if they, ha those of them who've invested here, you yeah. should see how they talk to their staff. Mm. I've seen some. Yeah. I've been, I've, um, I've, I've, I mean, when I go to places, mm -hmm. um, I'm in hotels, yeah. and sometimes I pounce on when they are talking to staff and things. And Even in this country, yes, our own citizens are being treated as nothing. Yes. And it's like we don't have security. Mm. It's like we don't even have.